Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to a brand new FIFA 22 video. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review and today guys we are going to be looking at Rodrigo Javier the Paul, the perfect look to Angel Correa. And as you saw earlier uh, today, I posted an Angel Correa review and now it is the Paul's turn, one of my favorite players in real life. And honestly, guys, with a couple of informs, this card is going to be the be one of the best midfielders in the Liga Santander. Is it Liga Santander? Yeah, it is, guys. It's still, I, I was <laughs> thinking it was Liga BBA still. But yeah, guys, he is 5'11", high, medium, right footed, 4-star skill moves, 3-star weak foot. I was fortunate enough to pack him, so I was very happy about that. And his stats are super, super well balanced at this stage of the game. Let's start talking about the pace at 78, 81 acceleration, 76 sprint speed, really good. I applied an engine chemistry style. You can go with a catalyst or a hunter or a shadow if you want to increase that pace even more. But I want to go as an all-around midfielder. I want to see what he can do with the passing department, the dribbling department. And I think engine is the way to go with this card. But if it's not, I definitely will let you know at the end of the video. The 76 shooting guy, 78 attack position, 76 finishing. All right, let's see if we can get a long shot or two with this Depau card playing from the midfield in a 4 3 1 2. The passing of 80, 80 vision, 85 short passing, 81 long passing. Good stuff there. The curve as well at 84. Onto the dribbling of 82, 78 agility, 79 of balance. That goes up to 89. So that is really good. 81 reactions, 80 composure. Uh, dribbling department is the best stat on this card, and hopefully he can show that on the pitch. The defending of 71, he can also defend a little bit. Uh, the 74 interception, 79 standing tackle, fantastic. If I press circle, he should be able to get the ball back. The physicality of 79, 86 stamina should last through the whole game, and that is what the Paul does. He's an engine on the pitch, and every time he plays for Argentina or it was when he then said, he's always everywhere on the pitch, and that's why I like them. And a big thing uh, that I do like about this card this year is that last year he was a high low player but now he's a high medium so it lets you play him more in that midfield department instead of the cam roll 81 strength as well he should hold his own on the pitch and lastly look at all those player traits guys that's why i wanted to review him as well finesse shot long passer long shot taker playmaker and technical dribbler guys as you can tell by my tone i'm excited to try Rodrigo de Paul is he worth it is he not guys uh, you know you're gonna see this card in Correa a lot especially the first couple of weeks in FIFA so hopefully you enjoyed this review and hopefully this card is good so let's get on to that guys all right guys Cunha has the ball se la pasa para Rodrigo de Paul let's see that dribbling Nice, I like it. Feel smooth in game. Ah, yeah, yeah, right there. Wrong skill move. I try to do a. I don't even know what it's called to be honest. Let's see his recovery speed. All right, good recovery. There we go. Good interception as well, making up for his mistake. Can lead to a goal though. Se viene Cunha. Se la pasa para el caser Cunha. What are you doing? Vamos, Rodrigo de Paul. Correa making the run. Let's go. What a beautiful through ball from Rodrigo de Paul. Come on, Correa. Nice ball roll. Good pass to Montiel. Montiel, the Argentine is connecting. Se la besa para Correa. Correa se viene. Finish shot. AI blocking. Oof. Nice interception, Rodrigo de Paul. Right place, right time right there. Showing his defensive prowess. And I haven't even increased it. Feels really good on ball. Great pass to Luka Modric. You like to see those combinations right there in the midfield. Coquilin, De Paul. Matias Cunha. Let's go, Matias Cunha. Look at the dribbling. Oh, what a move. And almost an assist for Rodrigo De Paul. He's the one that started that play, guys. the AI blocking let's go ah yeah yeah you see you're seeing the dribbling right there guys live ball control is probably one of the best features that uh, Rodrigo de Paul does have fortunately for the AI block oh 
Oh my goodness, Korea, I should have not finessed that, guys. I am concentrating like crazy. And we are on it, guys. Alcacer la tiene. Se la pasa para Cuña. Cuña el Brasilero. What a beautiful pass. What a play. Se viene. What a... Whoa. I'm just saying a lot of that. What a... Vamos. Rodrigo de Paul. The dribbling. Fantastic. Oh my goodness. He's moving everywhere. Se viene. Rodrigo de Paul. Casi, casi. We get the first goal right there. De Paul. Oh, what a pass. Oh, what a combination. Se viene. Nice. Rodrigo. Look at Rodrigo right there. Can lead to a goal. No, it can't. But right place, right time right there. Showing he can play defense as well. Uh, aside from the ball control, the defense is really good. And I have an engine, guys. Imagine if I had put a shadow. Definitely would have been a good force right there. Oof, well, that was closer than I thought. Good positioning right there as well. And he drew a foul, guys. You like it. Vamos, Rodrigo. Rodrigo de Paul, the movement. Ah, oh, what a dribble. Se viene Correa, gol. No, he moved the goalkeeper right there. But a beautiful run right there from Rodrigo de Paul. And great shot by Correa. We're getting closer and closer to that first goal. It is a tight game. This guy does know how to play, so let's see if we can get the W, guys. Correa. Vamos, Correa. So, second review of the day completed and the perfect link to Angel Correa, and that is... 82 rated Rodrigo de Paul. What a card in the midfield. The perfect starter midfield card for La Liga Santander. Especially if you do want to have an easy link to Angelito Correa, Joao Felix, Griezmann, or even Luis Suarez de Paul. Definitely fills up that uh, Saul Boyd. And guys, on to the pros. Number one is going to be the 85 short passing. That is the best feature on this card. His passing is insane. So expect a lot of through balls. Uh, correctly placed to your strikers from Rodrigo de Paul. Another one that I really liked was uh, the 85 ball control. Really good. Uh, there he is, a dribbling maestro. I really liked him combined with the four-star skills. Was a definitely a threat in uh, that midfield. The 86 stamina is a really good thing to have, especially at the beginning of the game he will last through the whole game and you can save a sub for another position in the 84 curve as well good stuff from Rodrigo de Paul he does have some cons though he's not the perfect card guys and the three cons that do uh, pop up in my opinion is the 69 crossing 76 sprint speed and 69 aggression yeah guys those are the top three cons for me and now on to the leo tip so number one leo tip is play him next to a defensive minded player a cdm because guys rodrigo de paul is better as an attacker so you don't want to limit that side of his uh, card and definitely if he goes up you'll have a cdm that can stay back and cover his spot while he recovers back and now on to the meta rating meta rating on this card is going to be a 7.5 out of 10 and final rating is going to be an 8 out of 10 i really did enjoy this card and as far as midfielders in the Liga Santander, the Paul is definitely going to be top five this year, especially if he gets a couple of more informs. Obviously, Valverde and Llorente take uh, the top two, even De Jong as well. But the Paul is definitely in the conversation for four through six, in my opinion. But anyways, I will conclude today's review. Hopefully, hope you out in deciding whether you want to get this card or not. And you enjoyed this review. Before I let you guys, I want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. I have been killing it with the support. And I love seeing that, guys. Please take a second out of your day. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. And expect more reviews here at Elite Foot FC. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye. And good night.